Yo, what's up, guys? The best class here. Back from another video. She has 6,764 trophies. Pretty top 2,500 in row right now. With 26 days, 6 hours left in the season. We're gonna do some live log gameplay in today's episode. And today's goal is try to get. Um, something would be great. Um, so far. you guys can hear me because usually the game sounds are super loud you can't really hear my voice anyways home to our next match that was a really awesome game against uh golem some mistakes he did was that uh, he didn't use his fireball for our inferno tower and decided to play an awkward night witch which didn't help him that much and we also got an awesome damage lead and he didn't have any re really great counter to our Gombrel besides Fireball, but it's all to your next match, guys. Let's go for a Gombrel, see what he has. He's gonna have Gombrel, Speed Place our Knight. Well, he's actually going in the back. Let's go for a Gom Gang. Okay, he's playing Gombrel Cycle. Um, let's see. Okay, I'm not sure what he's doing. Okay. Interesting, he has the Bandit and Inferno Dragon, the Goblin Drill. Um, that means it's probably going to be Mega Knight. Let's go for a Knight like this. It's going to Arrows. I don't want to go in for a Goblin Gang because he might Mega Knight on top and we will just lose the match that way. Um, let's see. He's going to Dark Prince. I'm going to log this Dark Prince back. Nice. 
Let's go for a princess, make sure it doesn't charge. Okay, that was really unfortunate. Thought we'd get the princess down in time, but we kind of failed there. Um, let's see what he's going to do. Let's go for an ice spirit. Go for a gom gang, okay, he's going to fireball. Let's go for a knight. Uh... I'm gonna go for the Gombrel because it's probably be low on Elixir because he went for a drum drill fireball. He's got arrows. Kinda of forgot he had arrows, but that's okay. He's going aggressive, so let's just go for a Gom Gang like this. Luckily we had enough elixir for it or we would have lost there. Okay, Spring Gom gets one hit, that's really nice. Probably gonna play a Dark Prince into this uh princess. Okay, that's a solid move from the opponent. Um, we go for knight pulling those bats back. That was like our only play there. Um, let's see. Let's go for aggressive princess. Probably not expecting it. Expecting it. Okay, he does. Well played. Um, he's going for a mega knight, of course. Um, let's see. Let's go in front of tower in the middle here. Let's go for a knight. Um, let's see what he's going to do. He's going to goblin drill. Okay, did not mean to rocket that, guys. Oops. Okay, that was a really bad rocket. Um, hopefully we can recover from that. Um, that was my mistake there. Okay, we scored some damage. Um, so he's going to go in again, I think. Yep. Let's time his Ice Spirit perfectly here. Okay, let's go aggressive because he just went for all his spells right there. Um, okay, Dark Prince in the back, that was well played. But he doesn't have anything for those goblins. In the front, Spirit Goblins got the damage, and it's going to be a GG. But that's kind of a crazy comeback, guys. Uh, kind of misplaced my rocket, but still managed to defend. That was kind of crazy. Not sure how that happened, but we defended. Once again, these arrows, fireball decks are so hard to... Um, break through or do anything because they have fireball for your princess all the time and arrows for your gom barrel or they can use either or uh, let's go for an ice spirit for his goblin uh for his fire spirit let's go for gom barrel looks like we're going against another goblin drill player maybe not some sort of uh, minor cycle deck with the fire spirit like it um let's see Try going to skeletons yep some skellies it's kind of obvious what he's playing Let's go for Princess Aggressive. Interesting, he has Electro Wizard. Let's see. It's going to P.E.K.K.A. Wow. Since his Electro Wizard's out of cycle, I'm going to go for a High Inferno Tower. Try to kill that P.E.K.K.A. He's probably playing a Balloon, guys, because it's a Miner as well. Um... Let's see. Let's go for Gombrel like this. Let's go for an Ice Spirit. And I go for Gom Gang. He's going to go for a log. Right, try to predict our, our Princess there, but we don't have enough Elixir. And it's not really good. Okay, he's going in for a Mortar. Just go for a Knight. And I don't want to go for an Inferno Tower, but I think we have to here. Let's try going Electro Wizard. No, he does not. Okay, so let's defend that knight. Who's Electro Wizard? I think that's opposite lane, Electro Wizard. So I just go for a princess, me forcing something out. Okay, he's going for. Okay, I knew he was going to try to fire Spirit us there. Be careful here. Go for Gom Gang. I think we have to go for a defensive Gombrel here, guys. Okay, interesting deck from the opponent. We managed to defend that fairly easily. Uh, he has an um, interesting mortar. Minor cycle. Uh, at this point, we just need to rocket his mortar because we don't have any good, other good counter. Okay, our fire spirit's going to connect. That's okay. I'm just going for aggressive princess like this. We spent a lot of elixir. Uh, he's going to log that. Let's go for a gombrel behind because he uses fire spirit and go for aggressive gom gang. He's going to go for a fireball. Okay. Um... I think I'm just going to log this mortar for High Knight. Let's go for our Princess Aggressive. 
Um, let's see. He's going for E Wiz, of course. Um, let's go for a Gom Gang. Okay, goes with another Mortar. He's going for Inferno Tower. Make sure it dies. He's going for a Minor Skull for a Knight like this. Okay, we kind of failed to predict it, but that's okay. Looks like he's going in for the cheap shots, guys, and I think it's time to rocket cycle at this point because he has a. Uh, Let's go for an Inferno Tower. Let's go for a Gom Gang. Nice. And I think it's a good opportunity to go for a Rocket here because he just went in for, with his Miner. Okay, he sides Pekka. Let's go Princess like this. Interesting Mortar. Let's go for a Nice Spirit. Go for an Inferno Tower. Okay, Mortar's locked onto our tower, guys. That is really unfortunate. If we get his Ice Spirit down in time to redirect it. Okay, we do. Um, see, so you is going to go down. We're going for another rocket, guys. Let's go for a Gom Gang in the middle. Wait, okay, that's unfortunate. We were late once again. Let's go for an Ice Spirit. Try to reset that Mortar. Okay, let's go for a knight. Um, let's go for a gone barrel. Let's go for a nice spirit here. Okay, uh, 3 HP, and that's going to be a GG. Pretty unfortunate. Uh, we couldn't really um, get enough damage for Rocket in Rocket range, and he pressured us really well with the mortars. Very really interesting uh, minor deck. He was able to um, get the win there because he had Fire Spirit, of course, to help defend against our gone barrels. We can't really do much. Um, for our next match, let's go for Aggressor Princess. One's got log, so he's probably going to use Goblin Drill, saving his Fire Spirit for our Gombrel, of course. So let's go for Nice Spirit. Okay. Okay, looks like our opponent's going to be playing Hog XC NATO with the Executioner and Valkyrie because he has Ice Spirit, Log Goblins. No other deck has that besides Wiper's deck. Okay, gets one hit there. Um,. In this matchup, we just want to go opposite lane, of course. Okay, he starts rocket cycling. Let's go for a rocket of our own here. So for Gombrel like this, he's going for a log. Let's go for a high knight in case he wants to go in. Okay, goes in. Let's go for Gom Gang and an Ice Spirit. Wow, that was a really nice tornado from the opponent. Yeah, I was really unlucky there. Right, he managed to outcycle us somehow, and... Hmm. Since he just uses Log and Tornado, I'm just going to go super aggressive with the Gone Barrel. And Princess, see how he's going to react to this, guys. Well, I actually predicted our princess, and wow, look at that. That was so perfect. Um, I think I should have waited until 10 Elixir PS. He probably uh, would have pre placed his goblins. Okay, he decides to rocket cycle us once again. Let's go for Gom Gang like this. Uh, Ice Spirit. Kyle gets one hit. He's looking really bad for us. We're pretty uh, low on damage. Um, okay. So we're going like this. Going for rocket. Oh, he's going for his own rocket. Um, let's see. Yeah, he just need one rocket and one log, and that's gonna be a GG. Let's call him getting ice spirit. He's just gonna log that. Um, okay, that's really unfortunate. It's gonna Valkyrie on top. Okay, let's go for Gombra off to the side like this. Um, let's see. He's on Tornado. Okay. That's actually a really fast cycle. Uh, we couldn't really do anything. He played super well. Um, always had his um, troops prepared on the left lane so we can get any princess value and 
He didn't use his Executioner once, so that was well played. Knowing that Executioner is not going to give him any value. And very nice well played to this player. It's on to our next match. It's going to be the last match of the video. Um, it's called Clash Royale uh, Log Bait Grind. It's always good to play um, your favorite deck, whatever you're best at in a crappy meta, because you're just going to get better, because you're just going to try to adapt and find ways to get around the Fire Spirit Log Goblin Drill. You got to play efficient, go for Goblin Barrels. Opponent's going to go with Skeleton Army, so I'm just going to take this log here really easy. Going for the nice wizard Skarmy. Okay, really interesting. He's going for Princess uh, in the back. Maybe force out a fireball or something. It's going for the baby dragon. I'm just going for Rocket here. I doubt he's playing Balloon, guys. Let's go for Nice Spirit. Okay, goes for the Mega Minion. And a graveyard. Okay. Let's go for Gom Gang like this. Let's go for a knight. Okay, perfect. Go for a log. And, okay, you just want to see our elixir. I don't think Princess at the bridge or Gombrel is a good move because you might have Bar Barrel. And we actually spent a lot of elixir defending that graveyard. You just want to see our elixir here. So for Gombrel like this. It's on a Skarmy. Little Princess in the back. And go for a nice spirit. Uh, he's going to go for a nice wizard. Hmm. I'm going to start rocket cycling because I know that I can defend his graveyard with the Gom Gang plus log combination. He's going to go in, let's go for an Inferno Tower. Okay. So he wants to freeze or something. He's going for a log now. He does freeze. Um, okay, that's very really unfortunate. Two skeletons. He's going for a Mega Minion. Um, let's see. I don't think he has a small spell. Let's go for Gombrel Ice Spirit. Okay, we're in a damage lead. Mm -hmm. He's going for another Rocket. Okay, we go for a Night High. Okay, that's not ideal for us. We have to go for a Log here. For nice spirit, I go for a princess. He actually used this tornado there to so go aggressive, and he's probably going to skeleton army that. Yep, he's going to skeleton army. Okay, well, guys, this guy's actually playing super well. Uh, he has a, a really good counter to our gone barrel all the time. And yeah, I think it's going to be a GG. We have no way to kill his skeletons. Uh, one HP and that's gonna be a good game. We unfortunate. Um at a couple times I forgot that he has skeleton army and took a lot of damage. He got so much value because I didn't um use my Gombrel you didn't use my log with my Gombrel at all. I had to use it for his freeze. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um really interesting decks when we're against Golem. Alright Pekka Hog XE and Greer, hope you guys enjoy this video. Stay tuned for our next one. Bye, guys.